Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This is a video in my declutter series. I have filmed this in 2017 so I know it's not going up before 2018 but this is the intro for every video so if you have seen before that's why I have used the same intro for every video. And a main thing in this declutter series is that I'm not getting rid of a lot but I have accumulated a big bag that I have now given to friends and family and my three cousins really really loved it and my mom and my aunt actually got some too. So I have a bit left and that is the items that is that are too dark for my friends and family. So I just need to find the right person and give it to her but they will not be counted in my makeup inventory that I am going to do after the series. Um, and if you want a makeup collection tour or setup or something, please let me know down below. So yeah, this is my declutter series. I hope you enjoy and please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on all of the videos I have planned out. And yeah, please like, comment and subscribe and then I will see you next time. Bye guys! This is my single shadow collection. I don't have a ton and I would like to keep it that way because single shadows is not really my thing. So in the future I believe I'm going to depart all of my single shadows just because I rather want to use it in a sepal. Let's just get into it. I have some glitters here and they're really not single shadows. I just got them in my advent calendar from W7 here in December. So these are not going anywhere. I need to learn how to use glitters though. Um, but they are not good anywhere. My Kigo iron sphere is not going anywhere either. I love them to pieces. My MAC shadow is not going anywhere. My P2, the future is mine, is not going anywhere. My L'Oreal, uh, Infallible, Magnetic, Cole. Love this stuff. And this I just got in my advent calendar. It is um, a Danish brand called Nina Jour. It is an eyeshadow silky touch single pot thingy. It's not a cream, but it's not a powder. So I have only swatched it and I want to keep that. This essence eyeshadow in Snowflake is beautiful as an eyeshadow and for a highlighter if you have really really pale skin. I'm keeping my Makeup Geek shadows and some single shadows I got in a Benefit Holiday set. Okay, so dirty. One second. But I'm keeping this single shadow from Maybelline. It's so beautiful. It's kind of the same thing as um, my P2, the future is mine, I just had in my Project McFly project pen, but it is so beautiful and this one is as well. I had this in my Redon project painting or something prior this year. This is like 7 years old and this spring in 2018 it is going to be 8 years old. So that is disgusting, I'm throwing it out. I was just telling myself that I just needed to pan it, but Life is too short. So, no, I'm not getting rid of it. I'm throwing it out in a trash because it is seven, almost eight years old. Need to go. So, and these single shadows down here, I'm keeping them all because I love them. So, yeah. That is my same pattern now, and I really need to clean this guy. Um, I have a single black eyeshadow. I don't use eyeshadow that often that is black and it has shimmer in it but I don't think you can see it when you apply it or you can tap it off or something. This is the only black eyeshadow I want in my collection in the future. It is only from like last Christmas so it's pretty good still. This black eyeshadow is going to a friend because I actually think she would like this. I have some here. I think I'm going to get rid of it all. This is a single eyeshadow from Estor. It is called Treasure Gold. I have never used it really since I got it because it's too sheer and I can't get it to show up um, on my eyes. So I think I'm going to let this go onto some of my cousins. Yummy Eyes Baked Eyeshadow from W7. It's so beautiful but you really had to scrape off the top to get to the product itself. Passing this on, it is beautiful but I have so many other Champagne shades and that is kind of the same thing with this one. This is actually a bronzer, but it's an illuminating bronzer and as I just said in, in that 
the clutter video I don't use shimmer bronzer so I'm getting rid of this as well. I try to use it as an eyeshadow and it is beautiful but I don't have any flick, fix plus or anything to do that with because I never do it. <laughs> so I'm just getting rid of it and seeing if anyone else of my cousins wants it because I don't. So I'm getting rid of four eyeshadows to um, give to my friends and then I have this purple shadow from Nina Shore, the same brand as this one uh, but it is 78 years old, so I'm going to throw this out in the trash. I just wanted to include my smaller palettes because I think this is going to be easy. I'm keeping my W7 Major Matte because this is beautiful and I love all the colors. There's no blacks, there's only dark browns. I'm keeping my W7 in the city because I'm pretty sure no one wants that much <laughs> of a used palette. I'm keeping this one just because it's neutral and it's very very handy to have. Then I have uh, my WU7 the 99 palettes. This is my backup. I love this palette so much. It's so beautiful. And I've just gotten the purple one because I really like purples now. And I really want to have some great purple shadows. So I'm trying this out. So I'm keeping these. I know it's silly to have two of the same kind. But that's just how much I love it right now. <laughs> so maybe later if I have panned this and I think it's now shit, I will get rid of this one. But right now it is beautiful. I love the burgundy tones in this one. I have these two quads. These are not going anywhere. I have made a get rid of me with these two palettes. Mostly this one. Um, it is the NYX Full Roulette palette. I don't know how to say that. There are like four more cores in this line and I'm so tempted to get them, uh, get the rest because they're so good. The pigmentation is on point and they're creamy and they're just amazing. So I'm very tempted to get the rest of these. This one is not going anywhere. It is my Maybelline Smoky Eyes that I got in Germany. You can't get it here in Denmark. It is beautiful. It's perfect. If you want a cool tone taupe look, I bought it in like October, so it's not going anywhere. I haven't played enough with it to have a full on opinion. Then I have my W7 Baby Vegan Course. Um, this is actually pretty cool because they are themed spring spice, warm winter summer sands, and autumn ambers. I'm just going to open them up so you can see as well. But I do know maybe some of my cousins or something would really love those. These are so beautiful, these bubbles. They come with these small sponge applicators that I hate. I'm pretty sure I have some dupes in other palettes. Um, especially this one for this one, you know. They are so beautiful. I don't want to get rid of them. I'm not going to swatch them because then I know I want to keep them. I'm very intrigued by this dark purple, but something tells me it's not that purple when you put it on your eye. I'm going to swatch it. No, you look at that. Mm -mm. I'm not going to get rid of them all. Oh no, I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I am. I'm going to do it. I'm going to get rid of them. I'm so sad right now. I can't even explain. Oh no. I'm going to get rid of them. These four, these four, and then this one. I'm so sad right now. I didn't think I would get rid of... Oh my god. I'm so sorry that I'm whining right now, but these are so beautiful. Oh my god. But if you take a look at them at W7 eyeshadows, I like these kind of eyeshadows so much more. They're so much better. And I do like this one a lot better as well. I will give them away. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm doing this. So this is everything I'm going to get rid of. I'm just going to do it before I change my mind and uh, regret and stuff like that. So thank you so much for watching, please subscribe, comment and like my video and I have so much planned for next year. I don't know when you see this but uh, just know that I'm in pain. <laughs> okay, no, really, it's just makeup but I love my makeup so much. I have said that in all my videos but I just do. Oh my god, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, bye guys.